of New Mexico trip. So right now we are at the New Mexico Natural History Museum. So over here we went and because I like dinosaurs a lot. So we just stopped here for a small look and to see what's here. But sadly it was closed because of Corona. And outside there were just like two dinosaur um, statues. So we just read the signs in front of them and we just took some pictures and then we went back into the car and we drove a little bit more and then we found this beautiful place. So we just stopped by here because it looked very colorful so we just went inside to see what was inside but when we were also very amazed to see what was inside the store so I guess you'll also be very amazed. That store was so colorful and there's some hot air balloons, there's small ones, big ones, and medium ones, and then they had some, um, you know, chilies, and then you know what happened? My sister, um, thought those chilies were made out of glass, so she picked one up, and then she squished it, the, the juice of the chili went into her eye. So there's a bunch of colorful, there was lots of beautiful bowls and some other, um, Mexican art. Since it was New Mexico, they had got it called Mexican art. So when we went there, there was some 50% off for a lot of the items that they had. So if you stop by, um, like if you stop by when you're going on a big trip, like if you're going from Texas to White Sands, and you see some beautiful shops, always stop there. You can't just think it's not gonna be good. Let's go. You can't. Don't do that. If you, we stopped here thinking it would be really good, and it was very good. So we also bought a big parachute and a small lizard, and then we put it in our house. So yeah, if you want to get one of these, they're also good. See, there's a pig and there's some, oh look. You would never see any shop like this in Texas. Well, you might see some, but this is like something that we never saw in Texas. See, they had some small bowls there, but whatever it was, I don't know how they got all of this. They're so fragile, they're all made out of glass and they're hand painted. So beautiful. You can imagine it. It's just so good. Look at every single piece that they had over there was so unique and beautiful. Like you will never see anything like this. It's so good. I don't I don't even think if you go to Mexico and see it, maybe they'll have a shop like this. But this is amazing. We do not see anything like this. Look at all of that stuff that's all made out of glass and how do they like pile it up like that and, and even though it's glass literally it's glass see they even put some magnets on them see? Look, they're magnetic oh we might want to get a problem let me go there okay so they even have glass soap dispensers i know right that's weird why would they have glass soap dispensers but okay that's still fine and they Bowls and there's lots of household items like mirrors, bowls, lamps. There's lots of stuff. See, there's a lot of mirrors over there, but the mirrors are really expensive, so we didn't buy them. But there, everything there was very beautiful and unique. So you keep watching, we'll catch you later. <laughs> Great. She's making my mom some coffee. And I'm like, Don't put that back. I'm like, Aww, I want it. And then my mom's like, No, you're not. They had a shop both indoor and outdoor. If you go to the back, there's also a place where they have metal stuff, but the glass stuff are all inside. And there's also some um, metal stuff outside. Like we saw this big bird, and then I like these uh, metal dinosaurs and all that stuff. But my mom said we're not allowed to get that because it was like, I don't know what metal it was, but my mom said no. And look, there's a donkey, donkey. And then look, there's a big cookie jar. Ooh, I love cookie jars. So the price range is about $7 because there was a 50% off deal for us. So my um glitter was $7 and then our parachute was $75. And then the price range is $7 if you have a 50% discount until, I don't know, about $600 for one piece. But um, I don't know how to explain it, but the art was so good. They mastered it. Yeah, they really mastered the art mastered the art yeah they really mastered it <laughs>
goes outside in the like the back part and look at all this I told you there's some metal and brass stuff and there's also steel stuff like that and there's also like some glass stuff on the back of the walls like moons and fishes like that see you can see the steel stuff no that's it on the back they'll have some shelves that are glass you can see there's some glass here see there's glass pots big pots so it, they filled the whole shop and crowded it with these beautiful art it was like we were in a painting a beautiful painting so if you're coming to new mexico you don't want to miss this shop yeah, you should have missed this shop. And over here, um, we found this, like, ch if you like chilies, you might want to come to this shop. It was not really a shop that we went to. It was just, like, this chili shop that they had some lots of chilies in it. Fresh chilies, it seems. And they So, um, this, they have lots of fresh chilies. It's very famous. New Mexico is very famous for their chilies. They're very spicy, and Mexicans love chilies. So if you're going to come to New Mexico and you want some chilies, you can um, make sure to stop here and get some chilies here because the chilies are, like they have dried chilies and fresh chilies, they come from the farm. So they make, oh see, there's some dried chili that they hang, that's a lot of dried chilies. Remember they had that at the painting shop and there's some fresh chilies that are not like fried and all that stuff. They have some beans and some other stuff, bolita, and then onions garlic and they had honey i don't know that it's a fresh farm so it, um it was really cool so now we're going back and i'll see you in the next video thanks for watching bye